I feel like a broken record, but it has been quite a month. So this video and the next one are going to be a little bit different. This is my um, Goodreads wrap up video, which I always follow with my longer video, which is the book review video. But they're both going to be kind of short because I didn't get a whole lot of reading done. Um, if I mentioned last month that, you know, I had a lot of things going on that kind of rolled over into the following month. So just not being able to as much to do as much as I would have liked, but still moving forward. So let's just go ahead and get into this wrap up. So for my challenge, um, I wasn't that worried about getting behind in, I think, June and July. Now it's August and September, and I am a little bit worried, but I mean, again, it's just the Goodreads challenge, so I'm not freaking out or anything. I'm just not used to being this far behind in the challenge, but I'm, again, not stressing it. For me, uh, because I do read so widely and varied, um, I can easily catch up with a couple of short reads if I wanted to try to do that. Um, I have no shortage of like picture books and graphic novels I could read as well as anthologies filled with stories that I could read so I can do it um, if I don't meet my challenge this year it will not be the end of the world but I do still have plenty of time it is only September um, I am five books behind I'm 36 um, oh, okay I've read 36 books out of 60 so I'm five books behind. I am 60% towards my overall goal. And them's the breaks, as they say. Um, what I actually finished reading in the month of August was just two books. <laughs> um, I started reading way more than that. Um, I'll mention what I started reading. Nah, I think I'll, well, yeah, let's go ahead. I mean, I got to fill this content with something. So I started reading Still Like an Artist and I started reading Fire Angel. And so both Still Like an Artist and Fire Angel were IWSG book club reads for the month of August. And I didn't finish either one of those. And not because there's anything wrong with either of them. I just, you know, life. Um, I had also started reading a book from the previous month that I didn't finish, but I did actually finish that one. So I'm gonna get into that in just a moment. Let's see here. What I actually did finish in the month of August was How to Write Dialogue. Ended up giving it an overall star rating of five. And then I also finished The Seance, which I also gave an overall star rating of five. Um, the How to Read Dialogue book was my um, Read with Faye challenge book from the month of July that I didn't <laughs> finish. So I finished that in August. And then the seance is just a book by an author that I really like that I always meant to read and never read. And so I read it. And so um, that is what I actually read in the month of August. And I started reading Dragonfly Summer, which I just finished reading in September. So I won't talk about it a whole lot, but you will eventually hear about that more later. That's another um author that I enjoy reading that I just felt like reading that book. So there you have it. Um, the two books that I actually read in the month of August, along with things that I started and didn't finish. Um, we'll see how I do getting around to some of those and my book review video will be coming up. So um, that will be a little bit longer, but not by much. <laughs> so that's all I have for now. I hope things are going well in your lives. Um, try to manage that stress if you can. Um, stay safe. Be blessed, guys. <laughs>